Obama launches epic takedown of Herschel Walker as polling shows voters might be done with him. On Thursday, former President Barack Obama made one final visit to Atlanta to campaign for Democratic Senator Raphael Warnock ahead of Tuesday's runoff election. The two-term president returned to Georgia and brutally mocked Republican Senate nominee and former University of Georgia running back Herschel Walker. Specifically, he made fun of Mr. Walker's speech a few weeks ago where he said he would rather be a werewolf than a vampire. Since the last time I was here, Mr. Walker has been talking about issues that are of great importance to the people of Georgia. Like whether it's better to be a vampire or a werewolf. Multiple news reports have come out about Mr. Walker's numerous personal foibles, from his allegedly paying for one woman's abortion to escorting another one to an abortion clinic. In addition, his son Christian Walker alleged that Mr. Walker forced him and his mother to move around for fear of violence. And there is now evidence that many voters might be fed up with Mr. Walker's antics. A new CNN poll showed that 52 percenter of likely voters in Georgia prefer Mr. Warnock to Mr. Walker. But the breakdown of other statistics shows some even bigger red flags for Mr. Walker. Only 39 percent have a favorable opinion of Mr. Walker, tying him with former President Donald Trump. Conversely, 50 percent of voters have a favorable opinion of Mr. Warnock even though 41 percent of likely voters have a favorable opinion of President Joe Biden. In addition, Mr. Walker faces questions on his judgment, as only 33% of likely voters think he has good judgment and 41% of voters think he would effectively represent Georgia in Congress. Mr. Walker also lags behind Mr. Warnock significantly on matters of trust, as 52% of likely voters think Mr. Warnock is honest and trustworthy compared to 41% who think Mr. Walker is. Similarly, many of the counties that Mr. Warnock won in his 2021 runoff and in November have seen prodigious turnout in early voting. Fulton County, where much of Atlanta is located, has seen 21.1% of its voting population already turn out. Mr. Warnock won Fulton by 49% of the vote. DeKalb County, which Mr. Warnock won by 70% of the vote in November, has seen 26% of its population already cast their ballot. Conversely, Bardo County, where Mr. Walker won by 50%, has only seen 17.7% of its voters already cast their ballot. However, 20.6% of voters in Jackson County, which Mr. Walker won by 56 points, already voted.